Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Selena and I love to create beautiful things and if you like that, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and yeah, I'm just gonna get into it today. I'm not gonna fiddle around with craziness because I'm kind of crazy enough myself and we're just keeping it real. Um, I'm just gonna do a get ready with me kind of video. I'm not going anywhere. I can't go anywhere. And I'm starting to go a little stir crazy. So, um, yeah. And I'm having really bad bout with my depression and everything is a mess. So we're just, I'm just going to talk about it, honestly. Um, but I'm going to, let me start with brows because I don't have those on yet. So I have a couple new products to use. Um, I'm not really gonna get into the products and like this or that, um, cause I just don't have the energy to do so. Um, yeah, I just don't have the the want for that. So um, this is it should be a review video because they're new products or not a review, a first impression, but I'm not really gonna talk much about the makeup. I'd rather talk about um, the chirping noise up there, no. Um, yeah, my fire alarm thing, you're gonna hear that throughout the video, I apologize. Um, I'm contacting the management in the morning, hopefully. Um, yeah, so I have been struggling. If you guys follow me on Twitter, you would have saw that I went, um, with a friend, like, on a social distance walk back in, uh, July. And ever since I went on said walk, I have been struggling with um, like a throat ache, like my throat feels kind of weird. And um, at first I thought I, w I was sick. I thought I was sick, but um, yeah, that was a whole ass month ago. So, I no longer think that it is um, the virus, but it's something and it's wearing on my, uh, it's wearing on me now. Like I'm tired of feeling like um, under the weather, wet, under the weather. Like I'm tired of feeling kind of iffy and sick. Um, so I, I'm i just tired, I guess. And so I like hope that I get some kind of relief from it soon because I'm mentally tired. And so this is the way I've been doing my brows lately. I'll just give a couple of um, flicks of this in the beginning of my brow. Some little fake hairs there. Because, yeah. My brows are very not existent. So, this is very helpful. okay so brows check I, I um I recently got this brow contour thingy from benefit and I kind of like the this little definer thing to like you know go in and if I messed up a little bit and go in and clean it up I just do it on the top right there. 
like so, like so. And that's it. So, okay, so, okay, after I went to that, like, little thing with my friend or whatever, I, um, I wasn't feeling the best after, like, like I said, my, um, throat felt, still feels kind of, eh. so it felt, eh, and I, so I called my pulmonologist, because I don't know who else to call, so I called the pulmonologist, and he thought that it might be acid reflux. So he put me on an acid reflux medication because I had been getting heartburn. And so I've been, on, I've been taking it, but I discontinued taking it last night because um, my depression or whatever has like drastically intensified since I started taking that medication. So like, I asked the farm because right when he prescribed it to me, I um, automatically I go and look up the um, side effects because like, yeah. So I went and I looked and the side effects said um, that it could alter your mood. And I was like, okay, because I'm I'm one of those um, one in three percent or something, three percent or whatever it is, the ones that have the thoughts of the word that I shouldn't say, um, you know, of harming your life. Um, so I have this. Uh, hold on, let me. Try to get it open first. It's really hard to open. I have the um, NYX Utopia one with all the shades. I thought that these were pressed glitters, and I was like, "Oh no!" But none of them. There are no plush. Uh, there are no pressed. Let me see. Wait. Yeah, there are no pressed glitters in this palette. So that was a surprise to me. Like super surprise to me. I don't know what I'm. What look I'm gonna do? I I don't really care. <laughs> keeping it real I, I don't even care I just come on here to talk really um so I'm just going to go and I should prime my lid shouldn't I <laughs> I'm using the Milani eyeshadow primer I mean I guess you prime your lids so that um the shadow lasts or whatever, but I'm literally gonna wash this off as soon as I'm done putting it on. Therefore, I don't really think I need primer, but maybe it makes the shadows look better, I don't know. I thought the purpose of primer was to make the shadows glide on better and then last longer, but I don't really need them to last. Um, but anyway, so, um, where was I? I? That's one thing that I hate about myself is that I know I trail off and I forget what I was saying. And the last time I was, um, the no buy video, like the last get, or, get ready with me video, I, um, kept doing that. I kept trailing off and forgetting I'm gonna go in with it you know what it doesn't even matter I'm gonna go in with a shade because <laughs> it doesn't even matter just a transition shade um and so I it's a pretty color um I kept trailing off and I'm like oh 
people are going to get so irritated, like, you're not finishing your sentences. I'm like, yeah, I know, oops. Um, yeah, so I, if I do that this time, I really, really apologize. But it's hard to remember, like, when you're trying to show makeup and, um, and talk about things. So, I don't know where I was. Um, so he put me on the, okay, that's where it was. He put me on the, uh, um, heartburn anti-reflux medicine or whatever. And I had to stop taking it because I started feeling, um, the feelings that I get when I'm on like a antidepressant kind of thing. So it, it affected my mood. So I was like, uh -uh, I'm done. So I just stopped taking it yesterday. So I'm still in the thick of it, um, if you will. I'm still very much so um, you know, dealing with not feeling my best and I, I, I mean it's cool because you know look at look at what, look what we're we're all going through right now so I guess it's okay that I'm not feeling the best you know it's fine um so I don't know what to do Part of me just wants to do like that neutral creasy shade and then um, the pretty sparkly green. With my finger and then blend it with the darker green on the outer. I don't want to do the baby minty green too. I'll probably cut all of this out, but um, I'm deciding. Okay, I'm going with this one, I guess. Would have been so much more impactful had I put down a glitter glue. It's okay though. It's still pretty. I need to use this hand. So, so I'm off that now or whatever and I have to, I guess, fight my way back to sanity and feeling okay and whatnot. But so I sleep with a BiPAP machine and if you didn't know that, I don't know if I've ever, why I would ever um, say that I did. So I'm assuming you didn't know. So I sleep with a BiPAP machine at night and that helps me to breathe because um, my lungs just aren't strong enough anymore to uh, give myself proper oxygen when laying down. Like it's called restrictive lung disease. It's a part of uh, muscular dystrophy at a certain point. Um, 
you know, people who are afflicted with um, the disease, you know, get weaker. And uh, mine happened a little bit earlier than most because other people my age, you know, are breathing just fine without their um, BiPAP machine or without a machine. But I got pregnant when I was 19 and, or I got pregnant when I was 18. I had my baby right before I was turned 19. So I got pregnant young and my pregnancy affected my disability pretty negatively. Um, like I needed uh, to be on the air machine to help me, you know, get enough oxygen to my brain um, at night and whatnot. So, yeah, so anyway, um, my air machine right now is uh, my apartment that I live in is very, like the, dr the air is very dry like very, very, very dry to the point where it's drying out my like, uh, throat, drying out my throat every night. So, um, I have to deal with it drying out my throat every night. And then when I wake up in the morning, it's, you know everything's sore because it just is sore and yucky and filled with like the nastiest stuff ever and um yeah so that's that's my life and um with that I've been um or because of that I've been not having the greatest like mornings or days or whatever because I'm spending half my day or my whole day trying to clear my throat and it's not clearing and I'm kind of getting worried at this point because it's not clearing so merch is going to be um because I say that so much but it's literally going to be my face I'm like um Okay, this look isn't gonna be for anything. It's just gonna be for pure entertainment's sake because, yeah. No, no. It's not, it's not. I need to grab a oh, wipe. Hold on. So I have um, this uh, It Cosmetic CC. I think it's new. I think it was new. I don't know. I need, everything's not really new anymore because I've literally waited so long to open everything because I was afraid to catch anything from opening the stuff, um, which I know probably not the way things work, but um, ooh, I have an underlining health concern that makes it very scary. Okay, got them on my hand. And they also sent a, or I also got a free uh, brush. So I'm gonna give this brush a whirl. You know, why not? If I can open it. Um. So look forward to um, Cleona, I'm not putting that in my mouth, <laughs> it's not happening today, um, my Cleona Cosmetics, um, oh, it's so pretty, oh, it's so pretty and white, I hate to dip it in there and mess it up, but what's the point if you can't use it? Oh, this color seems pretty spot on, no? I think it has good coverage. For being a CC cream, yeah. 
Yeah, you good for a CC cream. Okay. I'm gonna get my brow without getting my eyebrow. <laughs> get close to my brow without getting my brow. Okay, so I also have this um, Bye Bye Under Eye I lift in a tube and I'm assuming it is brightener illuminator and then this is the concealer and kind of corrector so we'll see what's Deluxe crease brush, and we'll just blend it in with that. Put a little bit too much on this side. It's like creasing a little bit as it put too much. <laughs> That's the what you call it of, of being getting old. Okay, so now that that's situated, let's. Dirty. Um, let's try the brightener side and see if we can brighten some things. So I'm gonna brighten right there, right there. Let's brighten our forehead. Let's in our chin a little bit right and right here that's yep we're gonna look different we're gonna be different because the hit my uh um what is it the 30 minute mark on the camera can't believe i was talking for 30 minutes still so crazy and you don't feel like you were talking for 30 minutes. I'm actually going to use my finger. To tap that in. Excuse me. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, this is iridescent. It's pretty. It's pretty. Set. 
I don't think a foundation brush is proper to set um, um, under your eyes, so it's probably going to be too dark. Just saying. Oh, my beautiful earrings. I got these on Etsy. Um, I will link the seller in the um, description. She makes beautiful things. I bought a whole bunch. I'm going to link the seller in the description. I'm just going to use the cover effects bronzer in. <clears throat> Sorry, in. What is this? Sun kissed bronze. Okay, so my point in my video was to speak upon what's been going on with me. I've been so for the last like week, I want to say, I've been pretty much paralyzed in fear and I don't want to live that way. So I'm breaking the chains of that today and I'm doing something with my time and this is what I want to do is to grow a community on here and have someone to talk to, friends. Um, I'm pretty lonely and this is my outlet so I'm hoping that this brings me some aspect of joy. Um, yeah. Yeah, so hmm. for blush, I am using the Cover FX Warm Honey. I'm just going to use this brush because why not? I can really overdo it on the blush. I do it often. <clears throat> I'm okay with that. Cute my newest thing to do is to totally just blush the crap out of my face and yeah just look cute and like cute and angelic I brought some mascara I don't think I'm gonna do liner but or not liner um yeah I don't think I'm gonna do liner and I don't think I'm gonna do lashes, but I don't know, we'll see. Sometimes I take them on my forehead, sometimes I don't even feel the need what up uh, for lips I don't know if I'm even gonna do anything for my lips because um, I tried let me show you what I tried cuz whimsical wisteria conditioning lip polish from Seraphine Botanicals. This, this, this right here. Focus. This um, did something terrible to my lips. Um, there's like a, like a layer of lip or like the outer layer of my lip is like, I don't know. It feels very like rough and textured 
and just it feels wrong it feels just very 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 wrong and yeah I will never use that again ever ever um anything do I want do I need to close with anything um oh a mascara guys please wear your masks um Wearing masks help, masks help um, decrease the transmission of this virus. And according to a lot of people, it's about to come back um, in full force. And um, Speaking as somebody who would be um, drastically affected, have, you know, if I got it, of course I'm gonna wear a mask. But if there's so many people out there not wearing masks and getting it, the transmission rate's gonna be so much higher than it would be if we were, you know, wearing masks and doing the right thing. Um, Yeah, so please wear your masks for me, for my lungs. They would appreciate it so, so much um, if you did. If you could find it in your heart to just put on a mask. Um, I think this looks really cute with these earrings. Um, yeah, so mental health wise, basically kind of just an update. Um, I've been struggling and um, I came on here to do this um, video and kind of share it because if I just sit on it and I'm just sitting here struggling and don't say anything to anybody and struggle in silence that's never good so I'm letting it out there I am struggling hard with this um, whole situation um, and and as I know a lot of you are so if i really wish i had a bible verse to read to you right now that would help you um i i had one in the last video if you want to go back and look at that one i um quoted um the it will not come near you thing i quoted or whatever so that's on that video um, on the last get ready with me if you need to hear like an actual quote from the Lord um, I'm gonna for real go off this time and make a new video giving um, what happened um, that I said like uh, God's moving in me I want to speak on that so I'm gonna um, do that I'm gonna just Turn this off, put a new car, new thing in, put a new battery in, and tell that story. But um, this one, I'm going to end it here with, um, I love you so much for watching and subscribing. If you have, if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do so. It's free, and I'm not always um, a bummer, not always talking about bad things um, going on in my life. I'm just being real and being honest and I hope that um, someone else needed to you know hear this or or it helped them in some way to know that they're not alone um yeah I think that's it I will see you in the next one um love you and I will see you in the next one bye Oops.